What's going on, guys? David here, Diecast Life and Death. Yeah. Well, so a couple of days ago, a friend of mine, Caesar, and I did some trading. And, um, you know, he helped me and I helped him. And that's the way it's supposed to work. But I thought I would go over what he sent me. I, his box already went out and he's already gotten it. But I figured I would show you some of the cars that I got. And some of them are really cool. And there's some heat. And, you know, then there's just some regular, mm-hmm, yeah. But, so he did send me this Hot Wheel um, Premium Real Rider Corvette. And I already had this one, but, you know, we were just, yeah. So he sent me this little Volkswagen Golf GTI from Matchbox. And I love the way on this little one, they even detailed the, oops, focus, the little red stripe on top of the grill. But neat little model. And like I said, guys, I'm going to pull everything out you know, in no certain order. But this little silver one's got to be one of the best-looking Matchbox Golf GTI uh, offerings that they've ever done. Next one is this. Obviously, you can see, you know, we don't care about the old car. <laughs> but this uh, Porsche, 96 Porsche Carrera. And this, this yellow... And this was just one of those portions that I just didn't have. I'm sure all of y'all have a dozen of these. Zoom. Let me let me set the camera up a little bit better. Let's go down. Yeah, that's better. Okay, sorry about the nausea, guys. <laughs> Try and keep some of these guys in the picture. Let me grab the next one out of the box. He's got them all tied up in these little bubble wraps. Then there's this um, 64 Pontiac GTO um, I don't even remember what set this came out of. Oh. This one got a little a little scuffed. Not really. Yeah. Well, get out of there. The struggle is real, guys. This next one is a uh, little Auto World square body. Part of the old, but look, another great looking little truck. Stay, sit, Ubu, sit. Damn it, Ubu. There you go.
Then he sent me this little um, Mazda Cosmo Sport. Then this Auto World Ultra Red of the Lincoln Mark V. Then this um, Car Culture um, 70 Ford Escort RS1600. This almost looks like a mail-in, but it's not. Let me grab the next ones. I already had one of these, but, you know, I, I just love this Mercedes. The 4.5 SEL. And this was one that I never could find. So he got me the Mercedes-Benz AMG E36 Estate Special Edition slash Edition Especiale. <laughs> oh. You guys visit these Walmarts at 10 o'clock at night. I don't know how you guys do it. But you know what we're going to do? Hey. This one needs to be seen. Don't get squeamish, guys. I know a lot of you guys don't like opening your stuff, but I do. Then he sent me this, also this um, Car Culture Datsun 510. And this one, this, I already have this one loose, but he tossed it in, and I, who was I going to say? No, don't send me that 64 Buick Riviera. That's horrible. <laughs> No, I do love this car. Back to the box. These three I did not have. Um, and this was out of the fast wagons, the old 17 Audi RS6 Avant in this, you know, destroyer gray looking non-metallic. Then this BMW E36. Was also one that I did not have. This will go into the old BMW collection. Just nice. And he scored me my runner. Yes. This one kept running from me. Now don't get squeamish, guys. But... She's going to get put in the jammer next to the old white one. And I got two more here. 
get them out of our protectors. Yeah, that Forerunner, I tell you, I was never going to find it. Just never going to find it. But now I don't have to. I do love that little Forerunner. So the next one he sent me is this super treasure hunt of the 17 Audi RS6 Avant. I'm not going to tell you which car I traded him for it, but it was another super treasure hunt. And the last one, guys. Was the RLC SS454. Dave, you're not going to break that one loose, are you? Well, yeah. What do you think? You think I'm going to leave it in the package? Not on your life. Not on your life, guys. This one is coming out. And I don't mean like out on a date. I mean, she's coming out. Well, if I can get it out. Now, isn't that better? I mean, you know, I get why a lot of you guys keep your cars on your cards, but if you don't get to enjoy them and you drop dead and somebody sells their cars and they're worth more money, well, that's great for them. But when you get to hold them in your hand and study them, that... That is when you truly have enjoyed your cars. Don't let your collection own you. You own the collection. Guys, like, share, subscribe. I hope you enjoyed this trade box. It was full of some pretty good heat, if you ask me. We will talk to you soon on the next episode of God Knows What We're Going to Show. Bye.